Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a productive day in the life. I decided to wake up and go ahead and start getting stuff done today. It is actually 1 p.m. right now. Y'all did see me cook breakfast. Um, I got done with breakfast probably about like 12.30. So now I made a little to-do list on my phone. And if you're new here, hey girl, my name is Akira Janae. Don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave. So <clears throat> I'm going to get right into this because... Like I said, it is 1 o'clock. I am kind of getting a later start to my day. Um, my boyfriend just left my house. He's been here with me since my birthday was Thursday. So he's been here really every day. But like he stayed the night, Wednesday night, Thursday night, and then Friday night. And today is Saturday, August 3rd. My birthday was August 1st. Team Leo, thank you guys for all the happy birthdays. Um, if I didn't get a chance to like your comment, respond back to you, your DMs, whatever. But I feel like I... They ain't responded back or liked or acknowledged every single comment or DM that I've gotten. So, he was here and he actually cleaned <coughs> um, my entire kitchen, living room, like that whole living space in there. Um, because obviously after my birthday stuff, it just got a little crazy. So, he basically cleaned everything. So, thanks babe. Um, now, I've made a mess in my YouTube studio room where I'm in right now, my guest room. Um in my guest bathroom we need to clean that so my to-do list was i'll probably pop it on the screen maybe let me just take a screenshot <laughs> my to-do list is breakfast clean up youtube studio um go to dollar tree go to my man house to clean his house hold on <laughs> wash clothes and clean out my car that's what i want to do today and i when i say clean my boyfriend house i mean um y'all know i got that um two-in-one type of sweeping mop and vacuum like the wet mop whatever y'all know what i'm talking about that i clean my floors with so basically like a knockoff dyson if you will um is what i got um but it's really 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 good so i'm going to take that over there to his house and i'm going to mop his floors because it needs it like he'll clean up the whole space or whatever but he don't really just have any type of mop i guess you can say um he usually just sweeps or he have that little swifter um mop thing but anyways i'm gonna take mine over there and i'm just gonna mop his floors um while he's gone as well he got like church stuff to do today like basically all day today so he's gonna be kind of in and out of his apartment until like four o'clock he's gonna head to go be with his anyways he got a lot of stuff to do he ain't gonna be at the house really so i got a key to his place he got a key to my place and he was like you ain't, like, you ain't got no key to my place you can just come over there so i don't know it's just something about when i clean his house i don't know i just obviously don't get me wrong i like to clean and decorate you know do my house as well but i don't know just cleaning somebody else's home or specifically his i don't know it just feel good you know to make someone else happy i guess you could say so yeah um that's what i'm gonna do i do need to go to dollar tree to pick up random household items that i need so i do want to do an actual household restock like a big type of video and a big shopping spree um but i'm gonna do that at sam's club and honestly not gonna lie sam's and target my total is probably gonna be about 200 to 200 to 250 because when i go buy in bulk like i buy in bulk so i don't have to go back for months so the last time i did this shopping spree i will say i don't know i posted a video i want to say maybe like i did one in january that lasted me through 
February, March, about like April. So I want to say maybe like April is the last time I did one of these somewhere around there. So anyways, we're going to go to Dollar Tree to pick up a few household items that I just need. Like right now, I need more paper towels. I need a little pack of tissue. Um, I need carpet freshener, just those little bitty knickknacks. And so I just go buy like a big heaping <laughs> order of those. Um, and yeah, so I was going to go ahead and wash my clothes, but I think I'm going to wash my clothes when we get back home because I don't want them to stay in the, you know, laundry and get you know basically um molded or anything so we're gonna go ahead and start cleaning up my um guest room and my guest bathroom so then when i come back i'll be able to kind of like you know breathe and do more content y'all know i can't think and mess and i can't function so i'm gonna give y'all a little overview of how it looks so this is how my guest room is looking y'all know i kept that table to anyways so that table needs to be cleared off i need to do something with that gate clear off this i'm ready to take this rug out of here so i am on amazon searching for a new one because it just doesn't fit the vibes anymore so i'll probably sell that to somebody facebook marketplace or something for like 20 dollars because i've had it for so long um that over there is pretty good all of this over here like my vanity and stuff i did my makeup for my um i did my makeup for my birthday the other day so obviously that's a mess and yeah just just get this room back looking how it's supposed to be looking because i just feel like it is so messy right now and my guest bathroom isn't too bad um this would be a quick easy fix just gotta literally put back that little bitty stuff and we're gonna worry about the closet later i'll probably do that in another video or maybe my weekly vlog to finish out that vlog because i do need to organize that closet again i'm gonna go ahead and start cleaning in the bathroom because it is less work so i'm gonna go ahead and knock this out the way and then we're gonna go start cleaning my um guest room because Janae called me and we was running our mouth but it's 207 everything looks good all that's clean I got my stuff charging I have to go ahead and put my flowers in a vase um I got some flowers for my birthday y'all will see that in that vlog but they've been out of water for probably like two days now and I definitely need to put them in some water so I'm about to do that real quick and then when I do that we're gonna leave and go to Dollar Tree but first I wanted to show you guys my new Rowan machine. It didn't take long at all to assemble. Probably took me a good 15 to 20 minutes if that. I do love that it is partially pre-assembled for you so that is something that makes it a lot easier to put together. I absolutely love when things come pre-assembled. So I've been storing it upright in my closet or as you see right now in my guest room slash office YouTube studio. The built-in wheels makes it so easy to move the Rowan machine without assistance. It's very lightweight. It's compact. It doesn't take up much space so i absolutely love that as you can see i'm moving around with ease prince is wondering like girl what are you doing okay so i have the marac q1s rower it is noted for its high cost performance ratio featuring a unique combination of magnetic flywheel system and automatic resistance adjustment which are unmatched at about 200 to 300 dollars is this price point along with comprehensive high quality upgrades throughout it does feature a 16 level magnetic resistance for a full body workout. Rowing involves up to about 90% of your body muscles. So I'm super excited to have this. I've been using this at my gym here recently and I absolutely loved it that I have one here. As you can hear, as you can see, it was very easy to set up and you can't hear anything. It's very compact and very easily to store. As you can see, I'm talking to y'all and y'all can't even hear this. 
So like I was saying in the last clip, this Q1S Run Machine makes virtually no noise at all when in use. You literally could just hear it in the last clip. So you don't have to worry about disturbing your family, your roommates, neighbors, what have you. It is very, very quiet. One of my favorite features on this, as you can see, my phone is up on the little bitty phone stand. I think that is so cute and so unique. So you can set your phone up there. You can follow a YouTube video, TikTok videos, any type of videos of different type of rowing workouts and rowing techniques. That's also what I've been doing these past few days, just following a workout. And as you can see, what I was touching right there, that's how you control that 16 level magnetic resistance for your body. I went from resistance to about what is that like eight i did go up to like 14 16 you can definitely tell the difference with the resistance <laughs> um 16 isn't bad but you definitely got to put a little bit more you know work into it so i've been kind of staying around at least like 10 to like 13 that's my comfort point right there the last cool thing that I wanted to mention is you can go to the app store and download their app. Once you download the app, they're going to ask you what your nickname is, what you want to put in there. They're going to ask if you're a female or male. Then you're going to put in your height and your weight, and then you can select your profile picture for your avatar. They have so much stuff on this app, and it is totally free. You can go along with this little bitty scenario, and when you're rowing, you can look at this beautiful picture. They have workouts on here for you. It's just so amazing, so go check that out. As always, all the information for this will be down in the description box below. Don't forget to check that out. The links, discount codes, all of that will be down there. And like I said, it is very easy to store. So I just like to store it upright in my little guest room. Very, very easy. Look like Tyler Perry But she don't love me She's too scary My hope is fun like Jackie Brown hey, buddy. I do plan to clean my car out today This is stuff that I need to put back inside of my car So I'm going to use this reusable Audi bag <coughs> To put this stuff back in my car As well as I need to actually keep this Audi bag in my car When I do go shopping there so I don't have to keep buying reusable bags every time so this blanket is a blanket that i keep in my car at all times you, know, you never know when you need a blanket and this is prince blanket that needs to go back in there in his car seat and this just needs to go back in my car and then i do have some stuff in my car that i need to bring back upstairs so if i do need an extra bag i will just use this to bring it back upstairs so i'm gonna go ahead and get some things that I'm gonna need. I'm gonna take this little bitty vacuum cleaner that I got from Shein. Um, they actually sent it to me, but it, it is a really, really good vacuum cleaner. It's the GMMO, it's the brand. It works amazing. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the charger real quick. I can also charge it in my car, but it's just charged by USB. So I'm gonna take that to be able to clean in the little bitty tiny places in my car. Ugh. So it has this type of like extender piece and I'll be able to like blow air in those little bitty teeny tiny crevices to be able to really, really clean my car. So I'm gonna take this piece. I do have another little mini vacuum cleaner that I could use to just vacuum out my car. Um, we'll see, I may take this or I may not, but this one does have an extra piece or whatever that you can put on as well i forgot how to actually do it i may go ahead and keep this one in my car to be able to clean on the go like really quickly and then just keep a usb charger in the car for this one so i'm going to take this one keep this in the car um with this little piece as well and then i'm going to put this piece in the car as well like I so much I don't get nothing back i really thought it was love but just a fucking wax always get caught up in love but
up day hey y'all it is 3 56 um now i went to dollar tree i recorded a little bit in there i didn't really record much because that dollar tree i'm gonna have to start going to the one <laughs> just a different side of town i'm gonna say because this one has nothing like the shelves empty barely anything nothing was there so i'm gonna have to start going to a better part of town and really going to the dollar tree that nobody really be hitting up because this one had nothing in there i didn't get any carpet cleaner or anything but as you can see the background look a little different i'm in my boyfriend house now um like i told y'all earlier he basically cleaned up my whole like living space area so that was my kitchen living room like straightened up everything and all of that and did the dishes and stuff so i'm over here i told y'all that i wanted to actually mop his floor with my actual um little thing right here this is linked in my amazon storefront as well it's from amazon so it basically sweeps well sucks up uh dirt and stuff like that and then it'll mop at the same time so he has a few different things that i can use for it that's his um i decided to do pine saw because i don't have any pine saw and i haven't cleaned with pine saw in a minute he does have lysol and then he has um, Fabuloso, the antibacterial one and all of that. I'm just gonna go ahead and use Pine Sol, but just a little bit in the water um, because sometimes it'll say it's full and it's not full because the Pine Sol and the Lysol create bubbles. And if it creates bubbles, my tank tend to seems like it thinks it's full, but it, when it's really not full. So I'm gonna use just a drop. Even the cleaning solution that came with it, I need to order some more. Actually, um, it said don't use any more than like 10 milliliters. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the stuff up off the floor so I can mop. Um, and then I'm just gonna clean this central area and stuff, the stove, all of that. Um, and then I'm gonna come mop in his bedroom and in his bathroom. It is hot in here right now though. He didn't have the air on in this room. So I'm about to kind of let this one, you know, cool off in here while I work up in here. Um, I'm gonna be listening to music on my phone there's something wrong with his wi-fi like the lights had went out um from a storm or something last week and like i said he's been with me most of the time but he'll be at work so he hasn't really been here to just fix it or anything so yeah i'm gonna bump some music on my phone i do have my airpod in but i may go ahead and just play it like just from the phone without the airpods and i'm so freaking tired um and i'm hot because my ears still out of my car y'all know that um so that's really annoying i had to roll with all the freaking windows down and then i have two small um what is it like small little fans that i had blowing on me or whatever um so yeah i haven't gotten a fix yet i think i, I keep telling y'all this because i am probably about to just get a new car here soon because i'm over this one i think i already talked about that in my weekly vlog whenever that'll be out but yeah i'm about to let it cool off in here and yeah we're just about to get to clean it i'm about to put on some music and yeah i would like to be at my house it's might as well just say four o'clock it's 3 59 i really just want to be over here for about an hour to clean up and then go back to my house i'm gonna get y'all dollar tree haul and then we're gonna finish doing some stuff around my apartment and getting some things done um i do want to still clean up my car but girl it's hot and like i said my air is not working right now like it pops on and off so right now it's off <laughs> and it's hot as hell so if i do go clean my car it'll have to be at like probably like eight o'clock when the sun about to set because it's hot as hell outside. Literally, it says 93 degrees, but it feels like 120. Not gonna lie. <laughs> just got done 
clean it basically a deep clean um he the apartment was already clean he just needed a deep clean so i'm done mopping and everything i sanitized this with some of the lights on stuff he had cleaned it out real good that's why it's still is looking wet right there because i put sanitizer all on it but yeah everything smells good it smells real nice in here can't wait till he get home and his first initial <laughs> sniff of the place um yeah so it smells clean it is clean it feels clean it definitely needed that deep clean mopping um i guess i'm gonna have to give him like a old cedar old cider however you say it one of those mops um for one of his uh housewarming gifts just gonna go ahead and do that um and yeah i'm about to go ahead and leave it's 4 57 so i made good timing my camera is about to die so i'll talk to y'all when i get back to my house because i didn't bring the spare battery i do have my little bitty dji camera but like I said, I just want to say I want to get back to the house because it's going to be hot as hell in this car and I'm definitely not vlogging in the car because I'm just about to be trying to speed in, speed to go home. Hey y'all, back home. It's 5.32 right now. I'm about to give y'all a little Dollar Tree haul, show y'all what I bought. I'm just messing up my boy <laughs> at this point. Okay, let's just take it down and retry it. My braids in for a whole month now. I got them done June 20th. Obviously, July 20th has passed. I think I'm gonna try to keep them for about two months um, for the rest of August, just so I don't have to do anything to my hair. It's been lovely. And I'm probably gonna wear my real hair throughout all of September. And I'll probably get my hair braided again like the first week in october so like october 1st probably or like the last day in september because i do have a cruise coming up and i do want my hair braided for that cruise but this time yeah that doesn't look too good but anyways this go around i'm going to use my own like curly hair from my raw vietnamese vendor or something because this hair is just not it. I would rather have like real human hair in. Anyways, it's 5.33. Um, ran into a little traffic, but nothing too bad. My total at Dollar Tree was like $30. So my total at Dollar Tree was $32. Um, really wish they were still Dollar Tree and not a Dollar 25 tree. I'm about to go ahead and scan my receipt. I didn't scan it there um while i was in the car because it was hot as hell so y'all know i used to fetch app it's always linked down in my description box below a lot of y'all have been signing up with my stuff a few of y'all said that y'all are saving y'all points until like christmas time and i'm like you know what that would be a good idea so um i have i've already cashed out two gift cards um so now i have enough to cash out two more but i'm not going to use them just yet uh, I'm probably going to do one for Amazon and then one for... I was going to do it for Sephora or Ulta, but my boyfriend got me a um, gift card to Sephora for my birthday. Nikki got me some Ulta stuff and, you know, so I don't know. I may use one for each one, but we'll see. So right now, I have 74,000 points. Um, and yeah, July, I accumulated 41,000 points in the month of July, so that was crazy. But anyways... <laughs> Let's get into the haul. First thing I got was some um, pepper cups, $3. Um, it was a pack of 40. I'm tired of doing dishes, like I'm tired. So I stocked up on that again. This is for my car. I got the cleaning wipes, this was $5. And then I got some leather care. I am gonna actually go to Walmart and invest in this one brand. This girl video had went viral and she was kind of showing the girlies how to, you know, clean their car. And she liked this one specific brand from Walmart that's really good and isn't like really harsh chemicals. But for the time being, I did need this. I didn't go clean out my car today because obviously it's hot as hell. And y'all know my ear is not working right now. So this is just my fan that I was using in my car. And then I got this two pack of um, paper towels it basically equals up to four regular rows so i just got two double rows and then i got another pack of napkins this is 150 counts it's a dollar 25 i decided to get napkins because if you know me 
then you know i don't like to use paper towels while i'm eating at like the dinner table or just eating in general i would much rather use a napkin and then save the paper towels for while i'm cooking or having to clean stuff and that eliminates how many paper towels you use as well so i like to always get napkins i'm just i'm just a napkin girl if you will and then i have like two more rolls of my charmin ultra soft that's my favorite tissue to get um i got this four pack of strong and soft it doesn't feel thin you know how you can kind of like feel through so i feel like this will be you know okay just to get me through until i do my full restock i needed some more trash bags my boyfriend did give me like three of his but this is a pack of 25 the hefty brand um ultra strong and i think i don't think it was was this five dollars what am i looking for 25 count yeah it was five dollars damn i thought it was three <laughs> i mean dang but it's the scent tropical paradise i'm gonna start buying the actual name brand trash bags because it does make a heck of a lot of a difference um like smell wise so i am just gonna have to invest in that so when i do go to sam's club i am gonna buy like all the name brand stuff because it does make a difference um i just got this speak and span multi-purpose cleaner if you know you know this has been an oldie but a goodie for a long time okay i used to use this in college so I decided to get this one because they didn't have any Lysol or anything. Like I said, they were like completely sold out of everything. And it don't even look like they've been restocking at all. So I definitely gotta go to a better Dollar Tree because that one, it was the ghetto Dollar Tree. <laughs> Just gonna be real. And they always be out of everything and they don't care to restock stuff. Um, I got some more cutting rounds because I've been needing these for my toners and just any type of facial wash well not facial wash but like facial toners and things like that i'd be needing these so i picked up some of those love to get those from dollar tree um these were the first ones that i saw and it was the better deal um it's 60 sheets in here bounce i haven't had dryer sheets in probably two to three months um i've been using those dryer balls and putting essential oils in those like we're dropping it on there and that kind of um you know makes it smell good but i'm not gonna lie it ain't nothing like having those dryer sheets and then i got a pack of clorox to go white and this i wasn't even looking for this but i thought it was super cute this was only five dollars it's a total of 168 bags comment down below if y'all seen these before at y'all dollar tree so it's basically just all the size bags that you need it's 50 snack bags 58 sandwich bags 20 freezer bags 22 quart bags and 18 gallon bags so I thought that was super cute and it's only $5. Um, I don't need any more snack bags. I have a ton of those, but I did need gallon, quart, and freezer. And if y'all know, if y'all notice, you can poke these out and you can just set this in your, um, what, drawer. And then you can just pull it out. But obviously y'all know it's linked to my Amazon storefront. I already have one, but I thought that was cute. Oop. But I thought that was cute. Like if you um don't have an organizer already, you can go to Dollar Tree and get this one and it kind of organizes it for you. So yeah, I thought that was cute. We're gonna put this little bit of stuff up. Um, the things that's left on my to-do list is I need to wash clothes really, really bad for today. All right, so I cleaned the bay house. I need to wash my clothes. I wanted to clean my car out, but like I said, it's so hot. Um, I may try to do that tomorrow morning. Um, tomorrow is Sunday. I would like to wake up and either tune in to church service or actually go to church. Um, I haven't been to church in a few Sundays. So if I can do that, wake up early, maybe go clean up my car in the morning, you know, tune in to service, whatever, whatever. I would like to do that. Um, so the only thing I got left to do today is wash my clothes. I do want to cook some dinner. Um, I don't necessarily have anything here. I was going to do some maybe like chicken alfredo but i don't have any chicken so <laughs> yeah and i and I, I don't feel like getting back out y'all so i'm gonna try to figure out something to eat tonight um i did want to maybe like cook something really cute for y'all but we'll see if i feel like going to the store then i'll go to the store and get something if not we just gonna have to get it how we live today okay and figure it out <laughs> again tomorrow so i'm about to put this up and yeah do what i said i was gonna do
hold me like that To everybody else who will just hold me back But I love when we make up like that And you love it when I make you mad But maybe we just love like that Yeah, maybe we just love like that Sometimes I don't want you around You do something to make me smile and It's hard for me to try to doubt this feeling So it's about to be seven o'clock and I have absolutely nothing in my apartment to cook um, except for something to make sloppy joe. So I found some hamburger and beef. I literally have breakfast food and that's it. <laughs> I didn't eat everything else. So I got a pack of ground beef and then I was like, Lord, please let me have sandwich so i got some sandwich sauce um so i'm just gonna cook sloppy joes i got this and with my sloppy joes i like to make literally me and my best friend nikki we used to cook this was like one of the first meals that we used to like actually like cook like by ourselves growing up and like for the family and stuff so we would eat macaroni with ours i know some people like to maybe eat chips with it some people like to eat french fries what have you because basically it's kind of like a burger if you will but we always just grew up eating it with macaroni so i'm gonna put macaroni with it and then i only have two hamburger buns left and they expire tomorrow or the day after tomorrow they still look good smell good already check them out so i'm gonna go ahead and use these and then for my leftovers tomorrow or i can just go to the store and buy some more you know hamburger buns if I want another one later tonight, I do have bread. I have white bread and honey wheat bread. So if I wanted to, I'll be able to um, eat some more later. I don't even know if I showed my actual, I don't know if I showed the vlog where my actual birthday is being celebrated or not, but he went to Small Cakes and got me some strawberry cupcakes. They smell amazing and they are so moist. So after I eat dinner, I'll probably wait about 20 minutes or so 20 30 minutes or so maybe an hour i'm not even gonna lie because i'm not a big sweets person <laughs> maybe wait about an hour to eat a cupcake i took him three and i need to go take one or two down to janae as well um because there's no way i'll be able to finish that myself so i'm gonna go ahead and start cooking i'm gonna shut up i do need to record like i said uh, um unboxing real quick a lot of unboxings and then i'm gonna start editing this vlog that you guys are watching right now because i do need to send it off to a company and yeah that's it right now today's vlog here and um yeah so i'm tired it's been a long productive day i feel like i've done a lot i'm tired i'm not gonna edit no video tonight 
uh, because it is 10:13. I'm gonna go ahead and probably take my sleeping pill so that I can go to sleep and wake up. Honestly, my alarm goes off every day, well, every morning at eight. But do I actually get up out of the bed at eight? No. But <laughs> tomorrow, I do actually want to at least be up out of the bed at eight o'clock. So I'm gonna go ahead and shower, take my sleeping pill, all of that and yeah i should be asleep within the next hour and then hopefully i can wake up fairly early tomorrow and um start editing i am going to upload all the footage to my laptop because if you guys edit or anything or know anything about the editing process then you guys know that it literally takes a long time for your videos to render into your software like it takes hours depending on how many videos and how long they are <laughs> how long they are excuse me <sighs> so yeah i can feel myself getting sleepy and everything i am gonna eat me another cupcake well i'm gonna eat me yeah because i only ate one cupcake um so i'm gonna eat a cupcake for my dessert tonight i'm gonna put up my leftovers and i will talk to y'all tomorrow that is but it's gonna be a different vlog obviously so i'm either gonna start another weekly vlog or i think i gotta finish my other weekly vlog so it's not gonna be a video on sunday obviously you guys won't even see this until way after but the video my birthday video that's not gonna be posted until probably this monday because i'm just gonna edit it tomorrow i'm i guess sunday gonna be my editing day while i sit back and have like other people youtube videos and stuff playing in the background Wait, I'm tired, girl. Oh. Oh. I'm about to stop yelling and get off this camera. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It helps me out a ton. And yeah, to my next video. See you later then. Bye, guys.